Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 notification video. In this video, we're going to take a look at the Atomic Shop, see what we got there, and also take a look at the uh, daily score, see what we got to do in order to make some score. So, let's start wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so first things first, uh, the thing that we have at the Atomic Shop is a free item, by the way. It's the Brotherhood of Steel Collectron. Now, it's available starting off today, which is the September the 4th, and it's available until the 7th of September. Uh, afterwards, I'm not sure if you will ever going to be able to claim it. So if you pause playing, I would highly recommend to jump in and uh, at least claim this Collectron. Uh, the other thing is, uh, big heads up and thank you to the entire Fallout 76 community for making this happen, for donating the resources to our current Atlas event. So, big thank you to you, all of you. <laughs> and I'm going to grab it and uh, I'm going to take a look how it works. Uh, so, essentially before we do that, uh, let's navigate to the challenges and see what we've got here. So, buy an item or sell an item from another player is pretty straightforward. Buy uh, anything from another player through vending or personal trade, whichever. Uh, collect uh, purified water. For that, you need water purifiers at your camp that generate water, uh, purified water. You collect them and you get it done. Uh, complete two events. Also pretty straightforward. Gold star, stay straightforward. Do any five of the dailies and this one will trigger. Kill a glowing creature. I will uh, explain how to do this one from perspective of a new player because this one will be a pretty challenging. Uh, kill a legendary enemy. Uh, you can do this. Uh, Johnny, come on. What are you doing? <laughs> Sorry. Z Jr. is here. So I would recommend visiting public events and uh, hoping to see a legendary enemy over there. Your job is to shoot it, other players will finish it. Because uh, on low level player, uh, for low level players it's pretty hard to encounter a legendary enemy. Although there is an event which I'm going to mention on how to get it done. Level up, pretty straightforward. Nuclear Winter, kill three creatures and you'll get some score. And lock pick a lock. Also you can, I'll, sh I'll share the location which I know off. And uh, I don't remember which skill is needed, to be honest. But the only, the first thing that comes into my head is the Landview Lighthouse. That's where you have the terminal that you can hack in with zero skills required. So I, I would assume the safe is also a zero requirement or maybe one. Uh, so instead of hacking the terminal, you just lockpick the safe and you'll get it done. So that is a light, uh, land view lighthouse there is a not the actual lighthouse but there's a house right next to it. you go to the second floor and there you should find your safe with the lock so the glowing creature i would recommend you to go to the clarksburg shooting club over there you shall find uh glowing cockroaches level five so uh you kill them and there's four of them though why do they force us to kill five come on man. well the best option is server hop or try your luck over here there's also some cockroaches over there but mainly they appear with another enemy so the enemy usually kills them <laughs> so yeah I would recommend server hopping and uh, kill legendary enemies I already explained one of the options and there you go leader of the pack if you get that event go there ASAP because there's gonna be three Johnny what happened mommy mommy not taking care of Johnny huh? <laughs> He's crying, then he's laughing, he's laughing, then he's crying. Wow. <laughs> Alright, so leader of the pack, you'll get three wolves. There should be level 10. If you kill them, great. You don't even have to uh, wait for anybody's help. So that is your only option as far as I know of. And uh, th that's pretty much it. I think I've covered it all. And now let's take a look at that collection. I'm going to replace it with the one that I have right now downstairs. And uh, there we go. Ooh. And bam. So here we go. This is what we got. We place them. This is how it looks like. Well, it's a collector. Let's see what it do. Oh, boom. Scrap, junk, camps and alcohol, ammo and weapons. I have no idea what that, the hell that is and what the hell is that is. I'm going to check it out though. Why not? Let's put that thing and see what he's going to scavenge. Alright, well, uh, that's a lot of selections, I'm going to say. 
All right, Zeke Land, and this is where I'm going to be calling it the end uh, for this video. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them. I see them. I read them and I delete them. So if you got something to say, negative, positive, feel free to leave your comments, but don't swear in my comments. If I notice you doing that a lot, you will get banned. If you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Zeke Land. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine. And uh, I'll see you on the next video. I hope you found it useful. So if you want to join our Discord, by the way, uh, the link is down in the video description as well as with the tutorial on how to use it as the Discord is over 600 members and we play different games so we have a lot of different chats. I highly recommend you watching that video as well. But thanks all for watching. Y'all have a good Monday night. Whatever you guys like it at. I'll see you later. Bye. Hey, it's good to be back and encounter some more bugs. <laughs> I like this one though. <laughs> Look at it. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go. We are the clan, we have a gamer soul.